，结果位置取消了。虽然我从来没有遇到过这样的事情。Which way should we go? 这个。Yes, in English. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So we recommend you drink the beer first for mm -hmm. the refreshing, mm -hmm. and followed by the lab scout and raw milk. Okay. Please enjoy. Thank you. Ah, we didn't understand his Dutch. Cheers. 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 对，甜甜的，它就是柠檬汁嘛。加啥？红薯汁吗？嗯。这个是牛肉串。Don't waste the chopping number target or chopping number fruit salad. Yeah, we have it's a sunflower fruit salad actually. So we mix with the truffle and bacon on top with a chicken ham, which is the pork shoulder. Okay, thank you. This is the first creation. This one is a lemon thyme kombucha. So it's made uh, from a uh, lemon thyme that we infuse with green tea. We blend it with apple juice and we leave it to ferment with this scoby, which is a symbiotic colony of bacteria, which made a lactic fermentation. Okay. So it's something that would be uh, a little acidic uh, since the fermentation. It's a sweet and herbaceous uh, finish to go along the end of the chapter one to act as a palate cleanser between your bites. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For this one, we have the wood fry. The wood fry is a traditional German pork leg. Today, we have the pork leg stew. It's a bit of half, a little bit of the lemon gel and elbow yam on and cheese. So, this one, I hope you enjoy it one bite because it's like a pork stew. Okay. From the southwest of Germany, in Baden region, mm -hmm. it's made by a vinegar maker called Dr. Reinhardt, and they use a making process similar to balsamic. Instead of using a red wine, they use a German pinot blanc for this one. They macerate it with orange blossom and honey, they leave it to oxidate, it becomes more acidic, and then they produce it. So, doing so, what's left of the alcohol in it evaporates, sugar stays, and this vinegar gets a more syrupy and sick. Okay. So we are going to use the sourness from the vinegar to control the fattiness of your next bite. Fatness? We we'll only ask you to wait for the snack to come before you try it. Of course. Thank you. It's a... That's called the Aleta. The Aleta, it's a take on a very famous German waffle uh -huh. that we call the Hanuta. But traditionally, the Hanuta will be made with chocolate inside and a bit of hazelnut. Mm -hmm. Here we change the chocolate to be duck liver, a bit of foie gras. You have also some oh. hazelnut and a little cream of orange. So I suggest you open uh, the packaging, then you take out the waffle. Two to three bites, and in between the bites, a little bit of the vinegar. Of course, okay. You don't drop. Thank you. Hi, Clara. Thank you. 
。那中间要喝这个是吧？对，吃两三口，然后喝。你吃吧。对。We continue now with the Al Zoup, which is a little soup, basically, uh, traditionally in the north of uh, Germany, the city of Hamburg. Here, what happens is that underneath you have a salad with smoked eel, a little bit of uh, different vegetables, uh, nuts, and fruits. Then on top you have a uh, meat consommé and fine herbs. Okay, a lot of herbs. Exactly. Thank you. Please enjoy. Beautiful. Shall I combine both of apples and now and love it? So the both of apples are typical apples from the north of Germany, really popular in Netherlands as well. Traditionally used for apple pie, we use the juice from these apples. We mix it with fennel juice and love it, which is a fine herb that tastes in between the parsley and the celery. So the thing is like this sweet and sour with a nice herbaceous finish to go with the acalyte as part of the chocolate. Okay. From where? Paris. Oh, Paris. Okay. Yeah. Come <laughs> here, Chiu. Side, you will have a little hint of the ginger at the end. Mm -hmm. uh, shouldn't be too powerful. Okay, okay. Don't shoot out it all time. Yeah. 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 The lobster is wrapped with the smoked butter. Today we serve with the fresh sherry and uh, we go on top with creepy beetroot. Oh, what, what is this? this? Yeah, creepy beetroot. Ah, beetroot, okay. Yeah. Uh, it's not green beetroot, it's not green beetroot. And for the sauce tonight, for sauce we have the lobster butter. He can see if there's any problems. What's wrong with that? Of course, of course. I'll have mine first. <laughs> Sorry about it, and we make the new one. Uh, first, 
Okay. I have a duck. Okay. It's gonna be your main course, my uh -huh. Hungarian duck. Wow, the smell. Thank you. And for the duck, a shape dry age. Uh -huh. Seven days. Mm -hmm. And then smoking hay, rosemary, thyme. And for the duck, a shape will cut the race part. Okay. Oh, where does the rest of the part go? The rest? Uh huh. Uh -huh Except for the for the breast? Yeah, for the breast, but the rest we will make it as a sauce. Ah, oh, for the sauce? Yeah, oh, okay. For the, we simmer the bowl. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we keep doing it for four days. Okay. We get it back to the mm -hmm. sauce. Okay, thank you. Yep. It's a combination of uh, light juice uh -huh. and a flower syrup. And lime as well to go with the fish course for tonight. Okay. For this one, we have the rock fish and the rock fish from Japan. Your okay. name is the, with the crispy potato, dry shrimp, a little bit of the vapor. And this one, we have the onion and the parsley puree. What is that? It's in the onion. Onion, oh, okay. And for the salt tonight, we have the seaweed butter salt. Seaweed, okay. And long peppers. So here the chef I'm using down for the grape juice, which are typical grapes from Germany with hibiscus to bring a nice floral notes into it. And then they blend it with long pepper jelly. It's something uh, slightly sweet with floral notes and a uh, strong peppery finish that we complement the to it. Okay. We have the highway collection from here, from this book company. Mm -hmm. Ooh. The first one we have the black and white ebony, this one from the Southeast Asia. The second one we have the dessert iron from the Central America. And last one we have the book ball from England. Okay. Can you show us? Uh, I will go with England. I've never been there. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Hungarian duck, shaped with the charcoal and wrapped with caramelized coffee. 
from what I miss, with the uh, red cabbage, with the shade nuts and quince puree. Mm -hmm. And for the sauce, you should I eat the duck juice. Okay. Beetroot and plum juice, as well, as I mentioned, but we're using plum juice that we uh, blend with uh, beetroot juice. Mm -hmm. We then have uh, some red chisels that we infuse and blend with it, and we finish with grilled cacao, which is basically what chocolate is made of. Cuba chocolate. Oh. So, very strong aroma of chocolate on the nose, mm. uh, slightly sweet uh, in the mouth. As a kid, it will taste like a dessert uh, to complement yours without overpowering it. First dessert right now. This is our Belgian muesli. So the Belgian muesli is a traditional breakfast from the southern part of Germany, breakfast? also really popular in Switzerland. Okay. Traditionally, it's oatmeal coming with different fresh or dried fruits and yogurt. So there's no actual recipe for it. But here, our pastry chef wanted to make a dessert out of it. Mm -hmm. So you will find a frozen yogurt shell on the bottom. Uh. It's filled with fresh green apples, an apple sorbet, and a reduction of vergie. On top, you have a yogurt foam with caramelized oatmeal and little pots of apple gel. Okay. For this one, all I will recommend you is to start with a large spoon to break the shell and then just go at it like you would with a bowl of syrup. Sure. Okay. Let's change it. Thank you. Yes, sir. This one will be a combination of pears and brown chocolate. This one I will uh, recommend you to start with a large spoon to break the shell. Uh, <laughs> It's a uh, pear and brown chocolate. So on the bottom you have a brown chocolate mousse mm. with a layer of pear gel. Mm -hmm. The middle part is a little chip uh, made of honey bread and on top you will find three different textures of pear. So you have a, a pear bowl, a pear sorbet and on top it's a pear chip. Okay. Thank Thank you. Hi, this is Kalia. So, this is Kalia, which is the really popular Kalia hat in Paris. So, this is for Harvard, which is a bike made of smoked sturgeon, production in Guatemala, Germany, more than bread and lettuce. And coming in is a whole team of the Kalia, which is the signature Kalia signature of the chef. For tonight, we'll be the apple pie from Chef's Grandmother recipe. Come together with the egg, not from the Chef's Grandmother recipe as well. And this is a recipe from her. Oh, the original one? No, no, it's a copy one. <laughs> but the page is really like oldish yellow. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So for the eggnog, we have egg yolk, condensed milk, vanilla, and German vodka. It's quite strong, this one. So I recommend you okay. enjoy the pie first and follow by the shot of the eggnog. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um, one more question for the main question. Yeah, I think I want it. Oh, cow. Yeah. 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 No, I don't know. What's that? I think it's like a little bit. You didn't recognize it. It's a big one. It's a big one. And he was like speaking erratically. And now we move on to your last dessert for tonight. We have a candy box or the candy box. Different kind of candy inside. Yeah, the first one will be the chocolate caramel with sugar. The second one, bomb cooker, which is the uh, chocolate in your cake. Yeah. Uh -huh. The second one is the white chocolate with the lemon set and vanilla. Okay. And the last one will be the mixed berry mushroom. 
Marshmallow? Yeah, mixed berry. Yeah. Okay. Which one would you like? Would you like the chocolate? Uh, I want the chocolate cake and can I choose two? Okay. And uh, the marshmallow mixed berry. Marshmallow. Just two? <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't like caramel and uh. Uh, how much can we choose? As much as you want. Okay. Two? Okay. Alright. Thank you.